Long Island's largest full service law firms. We are thrilled this morning, on behalf of the Long Island Capital Alliance, to have for you a capital forum featuring seven biotech companies developed based on technologies discovered right here on Long Island at two of our world-class research institutions. We are very happy to be collaborating on this event with Coltsman Harbor Laboratory and the Feinstein Institute for Medical Research at North Shore Long Island Jewish Health System. We've been doing these capital forums for a long time and we are always excited to showcase to the investment community the world-class technology that is discovered and developed right here on Long Island. For over 30 years, the Long Island Capital Alliance has been introducing local emerging growth companies to investors, facilitating their financing and growth and the generation of thousands of jobs here in our local region. We've helped dozens of local companies raise hundreds of millions of dollars and provided seasoned executives and managers to many of our emerging companies to help them succeed. This morning, after I'm done with my preliminary statements and uh, we have a few words from our two collaborators, we're going to see presentations from seven companies each of those presentations will last about seven minutes and be followed by one or two questions from our uh, investor panelists or audience members. Following our last presentation, we'll have a panel discussion with four industry investors. Following their remarks, we'll have a few questions and answers with the panelists, and then we'll wrap up the event this morning. We should be done by somewhere around 10, 30, 11 o'clock. I'd like to thank the sponsors of the Long Island Capital Alliance, the Long Island Forum for Technology, Carter DeLuca, Farrell and Schmidt, Livingston Securities, and my firm, Abram Spenceman, as our platinum sponsors, and like as gold sponsors, Insperity, Ruskin Moscow, Gracian Company, the Suffolk County Industrial Development Authority, the Corridor Magazine, <coughs> Citroen Cooperman, Market Wire, and Executive Strategies Group. I've been on the Corporate Advisory Board at the DNA Learning Center at Colesman Harbor Laboratory for many years, and I've had an opportunity to get to know many of the folks at Colesman Harbor and learn a fair amount, of, at least I think a fair amount, about some of the amazing things that they are doing there. My firm has also represented North Charles IJ for many years, and I've gotten a chance to okay. get to know a lot of the people in that organization. So personally, I'm thrilled, and on behalf of LICA, we are thrilled to be presenting this event this morning in collaboration with these two fine, world-class research institutions. And I'm sure that by the end of the event this morning, each of you will walk out of the room saying to yourself, uh, Gee, that's amazing stuff. And some of you may be thinking, I had no idea that was going on in Long Island. But it is, and I'm looking forward to uh, each of you learning more about it. At this point, we'd like to highlight these two fine institutions and start off. To start that off, I'd like to introduce, to say a few words, Terry Woolley, the Vice President of of Business Development and Technology Transfer at Colesman Harbor Laboratory. 